Hello everyone, my name is Ramat and today we're going to do a Garen mid guide in flex. We're going to be against Yasuo on mid lane and they are having a hyperscaling team comp with Shivana EP, Kale late game and Yasuo and Caitlyn, everyone is hyperscaling in their team. We're going to talk about how I generally play in this game uh, Garen and we're going to do Garen mid obviously, because uh, I'm generally playing mid. Obviously the thing is that he's mainly played top, but if you want to play against assassins on mid and you don't want to be an AP mage and you also have a jungler that's AP or, sub or a top laner or support, then you can try to counter Katarina to counter a Fizz with a Garen mid and stuff like that, even a so can be countered if you play decently well. Now I'm playing with Ignite and the only option is Ignite. You can also alternatively on top go for Teleport. I'm playing with Conqueror, Triumph, Legend Alacrity, Last Stand, Nimbus Cloak, Celerity and these rune stats. These two can be swapped for Resolve and you can play with... Uh, we can play with Unflinching, you can play with Deathman's Plate... I think that was the name and also the with you can also try the armor and magic resist at 10 minutes but generally I'd like to play with uh, with these for extra movement speed whenever I ignite I'll have speed whenever I flash I'll have speed also celerity enhances my Q speed as well and we're going to talk oh why did I jump straight to that we're going to talk also about abilities we're going to talk about uh, items in a second let me just focus on farming this I'm going to let him push level one his Whoa, 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 did you see that? Did you see that? How, how hard I lagged there? What was that? All right, uh, for items, for items, um, we're going to play, we're going to start with Doran's shield. After that, we're going to move to, got it. <laughs> we're going to move to boots. After that, we're going to get phage. Gonna cast E here, gonna go into the wave so that I don't lose that many CS. And this is fine. And a Q there. Okay, I lost only two minions. And so, for uh, as I said, for builds, we want to go Phage into Trinity Force, into Attack Speed Boots, maybe, or Merc Threads, we're going to see. After that, we maybe want uh, Phantom uh, Dancer, after that, Death Dance, after that, Armor or Magic Resist based on needs. This is the general build that you're going to be facing every single time. And you're gonna get. No! Got it. I'm still I'm still lagging. I can't move. What is this? What is this? What was that? Why why I couldn't move there? It's not even spiking, the ass is not even spiking. I'm confused of of what's happening. At least spike my MS if Alright, gonna cast W here. We're going to talk about spells in a second also. Just let me focus on the farm part. Gonna cast the Q there. I'm gonna gonna fight him a bit here. Gonna back off. Gonna max E second, and he missed that. And let's flash, get the kill, easy kill there. Uh, he didn't expect probably that extra bulk of damage that just came from that. And so we're going to cast the Q here. All right, E to get this minion fast and to push them into tower, and we can recall now. This went well. So we're going to start off. I don't have enough money for either of those, but I'm going for the longsword and the HP, also boots. I'm not going to get potions because I can use my passive. You can try to get at least one potion though, it's helpful. You can also get vision words, you need to get vision words. And let's talk real quick about uh, about summoners, about spells, sorry. His passive is this, you are regenerating health whenever you're not in combat. Your Q enhances your next auto attack with extra damage and movement speed and silences the target, so it's good actually against Malzahar ults, against most AP mages that want to cast uh, their CC spell like Zoe and it's actually it actually nullifies a lot of things and it helps you to get uh, ahead. Your W is this shield that gives tenacity, that gives armor and uh, the, the armor and the magic resist that it gives it's passive, uh, you are stacking it up and you're going to get uh, from each unit that you kill so I say passive because uh, you, you you get it over time when you get minions, but it's not actually passive. And your E, you spin and you deal more damage based on attack speed and you can crit with your E with the spin. Your ultimate is true damage, it's an execute sort of style that you need to use it whenever they are lower HP. So you gotta make targets low HP before using it. So I'm just gonna cast Q here. Alright. Alright, haven't used my W. 
because I, I was expecting uh, Shivana there, so I, I'll just back off. Alright, gonna toy with them a little bit more. It's fine. He used the Ignite there. I'm really... Actually, come on. Uh, I have level 6 here. I can actually outplay this guy. Hey, he used Ignite there. I will just wait for my shield, my W. I'm just gonna do a quick... Oops. Oops, oops, oops. So, as you can see, I'm trying to stay away from combat because I can actually beat him if I uh, heal up a bit. So, we're going to dodge his Q, then we're going to to engage directly on him, exactly like here. Alright, and ult, and we got a free kill again. It's very simple to get killed with, the, with this champion, especially if they misposition, misposition and misplay a bit. Also, we're going to max E, you'd want to max E because it stacks up nicely with the extra attack speed that you get from other stuff. So we're going to recall here, I hope they reach tower before, yes, fine. Excellent. So we're going now to get the Phage. I have my Ignite up for next fight. I'll also get... Uh, should I get Cloth Armor or Attack Speed? I'll get the Cloth Armor to deal better with uh, the Yasuo. And I'm going back mid now. We're going to try to kill him more. We're going to max E, then Q. We're going to do this the same combo over and over again. Q into E. Obviously use W somewhere at where there his burst comes. So when his tornado comes or when Q comes, try to block it with your W. We're also going to uh, do the main combo onto their Caitlyn, most probably. And hopefully not into the Kyle. Basically the main combo, it's very simple and very dumb all you gotta do is flash into q into e use the w somewhere there and just ignite them down and then alt that's all alt deals through damage much like darius so you're going to get a very easy kill they are dead here is this an ad shivana yeah, i can't do much to help they were not going to dive trash got the kill it's not okay it's not that bad either. I'm gonna get the Q here. Oops. Didn't get in range. I cast the W too late, but it doesn't matter because he wouldn't tilt anyway. And what you want to do is to swap to a side lane at a certain point and try to flash on their the most fed target. Do not use your ult into things like Kyle ult. Also I expect them fully expect them to be at Drake now exactly. So they just got it. I'm gonna push this. Your your push power increases Alright, we got a bit of poke down. We can actually flash for him if needed. It doesn't matter that he hit that, he should have waited. Alright, we're gonna get some plates here. Alright. Back off, we got the plates, it's fine. I could flash for him, but I'd rather keep flash for Caitlyn. I'm watching, I'm waiting for some gold more, because I need a bit more to actually be to actually be useful with the Trinity Force. I'm gonna get that. They are probably going to back off on bot. If they don't, I can think of a roam. But I can't really do much unless Morgana hits a good Q. You can see, oops. Go. Go, go. Yeah, you slip too much. Back off now. I'm losing too much CS on mid. Singed won't teleport. Singed has no reason. Singed has no reason to actually teleport here. Gonna wait that tower shot. Gonna move away. Gonna try to get it all. And now I have enough. I don't have enough yet. One more wave. And then I'll have enough to actually. Okay, got got a shutdown on trash of all people. Right now I have enough for the uh, Trinity Force, have enough gold, almost 10 CS per minute. And I think Singed will be fine on top, but Kyle will be a monster soon enough. Okay, gonna go back. And also Shyvana, they will all scale us regardless of what I do. Unless I try to ult on, this, on someone without getting into the Kyle. So this is going to be a rather difficult outcome, even though I actually am 2-0. And I'm actually doing this fine on mid. All right, let's let's dance a bit. 
<laughs> they don't want to fight. They don't want to fight either. And the fact that he recalled is actually good for us, right? Oh, I missed that cannon. I'm so bad. Go, 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 go. Alright. Get the Shivana down here. Alright, get the Drake. It's fine. Alright. Morgana Q. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. Good teleport by Singe. That's what we needed. That's what we needed to actually change stuff around here. I think I can go top now to actually fight this guy. I can beat this guy easily. I just have to ult not into her ult, right? So I do Q and then ult. That's the logic. Also, I'm getting her here. I'm, catch I'm catching up to her. And we're going to be just fine. Alright. And we got the flash down, we got the kill. Someone needs to stick around here, although the plates are no longer, so we're fine. You are going very, very badly and very, very deeply. One one tower here also, first tower. And they got treasures, fine. I am very ahead at this point. And I can even do some counter jungling, but if Yasuo gets lots of kills, if they fail there, that can turn into a problem immediately. It's fine, still fine. Kyle teleport, okay, I could keep going for this tower, although I'd rather just get the farm, because I wouldn't be able to get the tower, but I am able to actually get down here. She loses CS anyway, so I am able to get here a lot of stuff from Shivana, and she will be forced to actually roam. Also, lots of farm, as you can see. And Kyle, as I said, loses a lot of here. Oops, I stopped my. Alright. So I'm very, very far ahead right now. I'm, at, as I said, at 10 CS per minute, I'm gonna push mid, and then we're moving towards other stuff. Not having flash, not having ignite, not rushing towards anything really. And I missed another cannon. Man, I should stop missing those cannons. Two levels ahead, by the way. And I can freely recall now going for the Phantom Dancer. I instantly have it. I'm getting it instantly because it's better than waiting for uh, for the boots. Uh, okay. I won't be able... Oh, nice. That's nice. I won't be able to actually help. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Now we do the engage <laughs> if it's required. Okay, it's fine. Back off. We're going mid. Back off. Let's get let's get mid. Let's get their stuff. All right. Is the herald that's going to get instantly the tower, and we can push for a second tower here. And Shiv Shivana is back. We know that for sure. Yeah, so we can just. Two towers there, very simple, very beautifully, by the way. Maybe get another hit here. Alright, that's fine. Back, 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 back. Tank this for her. Back off, we're fine. I just wanna run, honestly. Because they can't really catch me, but Kyle is coming as well. So it's fine. Also, 14 levels. Level 14, yes, so it's 12. Can go for Scuttle here. We also got top tower. We're, we're actually winning by very good macro. That's clear. I'm gonna push this real quick. Gonna check for some Shivana camps. Definitely a blue somewhere there. I'm gonna put this here. Very, very fast. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna spin away. I'm gonna do a Q here nicely. I'm gonna gonna counter jungle as much as I can. Alright. Hopefully I get this. Yeah, she she's actually bot side. 
and we're going to farm this lane as well keeping up that advantage as much as we can as you can see level 15 Yasuo is 12 creating that discrepancy getting that W now and we're moving here can't really help them unless I'm coming fast so I'm gonna get this I also have for this and we can move towards this dance now we're gonna int it probably here Ah, if they kill Shivana, it's good. Okay, she didn't have time to hold, so we won this. Mm. It's fine. It's fine, we're winning, okay. And she just comes from the back, okay. Nice, well played. Really well played there. So I'm just gonna push mid now. We can actually do Kyle, we can actually kill Kyle if you want to. Do this. Actually, going to get this tower. If he gets that auto attack down, I'm gonna W. Right, and we can let's get an inhibitor. And this game seems up, seems to go towards the we just macro out macro them route, which which is fine. And the also seems to int, which is great for me. We can just go for towers now. Okay. Okay, is real inted. A bit. Ah, hate that he types. Back off. Ah, I should have flash for him. I'm escaping this. I don't mind it. I'm just gonna get some farm from the Elise. She could have could have flash for that. But then again, wasting flash, and I could just okay. Let me work. I'm one versus nine here. Uh, what do we do? We risk it. We gotta risk it. I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna actually jump on Shyvana. Have to jump on Shyvana. Ah, didn't get the. Didn't get the Baron. Shivana can't jump. Shivana definitely can't jump, so we got it for free. Oh, look. Okay, it's fine. Nice. Why is Shivana inting? I can't get. Oh my god. So many traps. That's nice, fine. Back off. Let's gonna let's cast an E here. All right, level sixteen soon, guys. Careful. All right, and we can now can now hit this. We can easily get this tower. I'm gonna cast E here. Hopefully, level sixteen soon. Yeah. No, go 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 go. Go. I'm actually diving this. Oh my god, that I did not really did not expect the wall from that. The wall, the wall is what tripped me off on that ult. I'm going there. I don't care. But since since ah since stayed okay, it's fine. It's fine. We got the tower. I did a bit of a bit. A big dive there which wasn't right but it's fine unless unless we they get both in hips up now and also the drake and also the baron we're still standing good even though they outscale heavily they outscale us heavily we need we need to stop the kyle from doing stuff so that means i have to flash on her and that's in two minutes so right now i need to go for ap so adaptive film is that works best in this case because Kyle's damage needs is kind of adaptive, right? Because it's not instant, it's not burst. Uh, Shivana's damage is kind of burst with her E, but it's fine. If they are chasing too much in that direction. Alright, let's try. I don't think I am able to. Nah. Okay, she didn't. <laughs> she didn't ult. 
at the right time. <laughs> she should have ulted one second faster. She didn't have time to do that. And now we can just roll over this inhibitor. We also full HP. I should have lost that. She should have casted ult on herself. And this is bad, guys. If you play Kyle like that and you misplay like this, it costs you the game. And this is exactly what's happening now. I'm actually taking inhibs here for free. I actually can take this tower as well. As you can see, the tower isn't even damaging me. So I can just push, right? I could flash ult the Caitlyn, which I will. I'm just gonna do all my damage now in hopes that they will take the tower. Alright, and it's fine. Get the tower as well, and we back off. Back, back, back. I don't know why Morgana didn't. Oh my god, that flash. It's fine, it's fine. Now they have the Nexus open, which is considerably harder for them to do anything. And I have an adaptive helm and death dance as well. Maybe some more attack speed could actually turn the tide around the Kyle. But you can see the only two deaths she has are from me. And well, my only deaths are from either suicides, like getting a kill, getting pushing towards something and getting other objectives, or we, we can burn here, sure. Man, why did you? Okay, it's fine, we won. We heavily won this. We don't win this because these two. Uh, these two players. Uh, <laughs> Israel and. Uh, words. Right, we can go now. Alright, this time he casted it right. Gonna need to get out. And free kill right there. She used ult there and that costed her. Cost her a lot. And they can't really fight us. Without Kyle they aren't doing anything. And here Shivana should have actually jumped. Alright, got her down. And now we can get mid, we can get stuff there. Yasu is useless. Can you throw him though? Alright. Got that. And I am stronger <laughs> by far than Yasu. Man. I'm gonna chase him down. <laughs> Israel should take that. I actually catch this guy. I'm pretty sure that if Israel is not careful here, he might die. But we're fine. I'm not catching this guy because it's okay. If you think that damages me, I have bad news for you. Nice. We, we can actually get the Drake now. And they expect us to not be here. They don't have words here. They definitely don't have words. They kind of is going to get there. And obviously, I haven't altered. Just gonna spin, spin to win. Uh, I'm not getting damaged by the Caitlyn. <laughs> I'm gonna chase her down. I'm okay, backing off. Man, all right, all right is fine. Actually, I could go. I could go and take Inhib because she has to heal up. All right, gonna take this real quick so we don't actually struggle. I can't go for the Nexus though because she would just kill me. And we got her. I think we won the game here solo. 
Alright, let's get it done. Let's go, boys! Woohoo! <laughs> she didn't expect me to turn. Uh, that was the game. That was the Garen Mid Guide. I really hope you enjoyed it a bit longer than expected. But it was fine in the end, I suppose. So this was the video, guys. I really hope it worked for you. And see you next time. Goodbye, guys.